Here I'm going to show you how to add time past 24 hours within Excel. So in this example, I've got a worksheet where we've got, let's say, a worker that inputs when he starts work and when he ends work. We can calculate how long he's worked for each day, and then we want to add that up on a weekly basis. So this is a very simple example, but if you've ever tried to do this on your own, you may have got some kind of funky results when you add everything together. So I'm going to show you how to get some very simple results for adding hours together. Now when we calculate how long a person has worked for the day, we simply do equals the time when they finished minus the time when they started. Hit enter and it's going to give us something which kind of seems right. So we've got 8 hours, but then it says AM. That's a little bit confusing, but we don't actually have to change anything at this point. So as long as how long the worker has worked per day is less than 24 hours, we don't actually have to change the formatting right there. Now I simply copied the formula down so it works for every day. Now the problem comes when we want to total everything. So I'm going to use a very simple sum formula equals sum open parentheses, select the cells that I want to add together, hit enter. And you can see it gives us a really odd result, 4 p.m. Now that really doesn't help us at all. We want to know the total hours that this person has worked. So what you can do, it's actually quite simple, is to right click this cell, go to format cells, on the number tab, you can do it two ways, in the time category or in the custom category. So select time and go down to where it says 37 colon 30 colon 55. Look to the top first, we see our sample. This is what the output is going to look like if we change the formatting. Right now it says 4 p.m. If we change it to 37 30 55, we get 40 hours. So hit OK. And there you go. So that's going to give you the total hours that this person has worked. Now the other way to do it through format cells is in the custom category. Now what you want to do here is to select this option. H colon MM colon SS. Notice that the sample remains at 40. and once again 40 hours. So the two formats that we can use, remember right click the cell, format cells, number tab, we've got time at 3730.55 or custom at HMMSS. Now if you wanted, you could also format these cells like that, so that instead of seeing 8 a.m., we just saw the total hours worked. So what I will do here is right click or select all of them, right click, format cells, custom, right there, and OK. Now once again, we could sum these numbers. And notice that if you change the formatting before you apply the sum, you already get 40 hours returned. So you can either leave the formatting off here and apply it to the end result, or apply it here, and then you don't have to worry about it when you go to add up all the hours. Either way, just remember that all you have to do is right-click Format Cells, Number Tab, Category, Custom, HMMSS or time 373055. And that's a really simple way to add time past 24 hours within Excel.